Hello everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be checking out the new Shires. I am very excited for these because I feel like they have definitely needed a well-deserved update and upgrade. Um, I don't know how many I'm going to be getting because I have about 5,000 star coins. So I might get one, I might get two, I might get zero. The max that I will probably get is two. Um, this photo that they have given us right here, I'm not really like wanting any of these three so probably not those three um but i just yawned sorry guys um let's get into reading the news the shire gets an upgrade yay <laughs> hey star fam the brand new shire horse has arrived in your week along with some medieval bridles the shire horse the, the Magnific, Magnificent Shire is a draft horse hauling from England known as the gen, ja, known as a gentle giant. Sh um, the Shire holds records for the height and strength. Other characteristics are the feathering on their legs and the impressive size of their hooves. A cold-blooded breed, Shires are inclined to work and eager to please. Okay. Good to know. Shire horses were brought to Jorvik by the Silver Glade family, who prized them as grand carriage horses. Although this horse is a force of nature, it is do its docile temperament makes it a good companion to any rider. The new breed is the Shub. The uh, Shub. What's the Shub? I don't know. The Shire. Um, you can, there's one in Fort Pinda and the rest are at Steve's Farm, and I think there's one on the app as well coming out later. So, yeah. They cost 900 star coins. Um, you can get the Fort Pinda one at any level, and you have to be level 8 to get the rest in, um, Steve's Farm. Um, there are going to be six, one, six to choose from. They have a special move. Click on the space bar while it's standing still, and they will lie down and sit up. Um, medieval bridles. Okay, the Hackamore is a fancy bitless bridle. The horn bridle is perfect for any fantasy fan. The medieval bridle make your horse look like it belongs to royalty. I don't know which one's the Hackamore. This is the horned one, and I'm going to guess this is the medieval one. So, I guess this is a new one, which this is, like, what I want. So, yeah. Um... Magical Horse Rotations, Ares and Petra. The Shire Horse aren't the only arrivals this week. Gary Goldtooth has some visitors. Ares and Petra, along with their bunny pets, um, can be found at Gary's camp in Moreland for the next month. These magical runestone horses you can join your stable for 750 star coins each. Petra's hoofsteps can make the ground crumble, but as Petra is a giant soul, they... Uh, a gentle soul they don't want to see the world destroyed under their hooves that's why you can often find petra standing still as a statue among nature allowing vines and flowers to grow on their back this relaxed attitude makes petra an easy going riding partner happy to mend her trails and stop to munch on moss so i'm gonna guess this is petra and then sometimes dark forces can corrupt these scattered ruins. Crumbling these monuments, it is from these scattered s signals that Ares was born. Ares' fierce and tireless nature makes them a des uh, dedicated riding companion, always eager to push their limits and become strong stronger and faster. Born in shadows, Ares hopes one day to be welcomed back to Earth from which it sprung perhaps by bonding with this tragic seed you can help it come a few steps closer to redemption okay and then we have the rune pens the happy-go-lucky bunny with um petra and then we have who else we have bunny of darkness so yeah and then we have this new saddle bag which i really like it actually now i just wanted to quickly go onto youtube and check out cc creations video to check out the hack amours or the new bridles um to see that so that's right here 
Oh no, there's an ad. So I don't know if this works on everyone, but I have found that you just gotta restart the page multiple times. And then it should just give you the video. Let's see if it works. I know, oh my gosh, it works, I think. No, I spoke too soon. This one at least has a skip one. But yeah, it works on my phone and it works on my iPad. So yeah, Um, let's see, it's down here. The new Western Bridal. This is, I think, what I want. Hopefully, we'll get it today. So, yeah, I really want this. I think it's so cute. It looks so cute. But this is the only part that I don't like. And I don't really like this bit, too. But it's fine. So, I hope we get these today. I think they are really nice and, like, detailed and cute. I, I'm also excited to see these with the NPCs. But, yeah, let's go ahead and go and get the shire actually let me double check that i am recording because hi everyone hi okay so yeah but let's go so meet the updated shires and fit your new shire with new variations of medieval bridles okay so here we are in the global store looks like they only actually no they did come out with silver so i don't know how i feel about these ones um or the horn Um, are these the new ones? I don't think they are. No, they're not. Okay, well, I don't think they got released today, so that's okay. Um, yeah, I'm on King, but let's go ahead and check these new guys out. So, there are a few here, and then one at Fort Panda, so... So this is the bay. Um, it has a lot of dapples, so I don't really like it. So this one is a no. And then we have this light gray. I don't like it because of the dappled butt, so that's a no. This one just looks too similar to the um, the Pasifino over there. Plus, it's like not as good as the Pasifino. Like the face marking is very similar, and also this one has no leg markings compared to that one. So if I had to choose between those two, it would be that one over there. Um, next we have this gray. Um, this more darker gray. I just don't like this gray. I don't know why. Um, I I'll, I could get it, and this could be like the updated Ace. I feel like. You know? But I like Ace how he is, so no. And then this one, this is another option. I like the face, but I don't like the body. So this one is a no. Um, and then I know there's one at Fort Pinta, so let's go there real quick. And I think that's the one that I'm going to get because I really like the black one. So I think I want that one. Um, so yeah, I'm just, I've been thinking about it, and I think I'm going to use them in my, the one in my role plays. Like, this guy, I want to name him Angus. He's really cute. I like him a lot. I want to get, like, a closer look at him. So, he's a bit more shiny than King, but that's okay. Um, I love their, like, hair. This face is so cute. They're, like, gentle giants. They're so cute. But I kind of want to name this horse Angus. Um, but at the same time, I kind of want to name it Millie. So, here's a quick story for you guys. So, I love dogs, if you did not know. I own two dogs right now. Me and my family own um, a little white lab named Nanook which means polar bear and a yellow lab my dog named Bella and before we got Nanook and before we had Bella my parents adopted um, and rescued a little uh, not little but rescued a dog named Millie she um she like was my older sister because I've never had siblings no fun fact about me but I'm an only child so I've never had any siblings and she was like the my older sister sadly she passed away um a couple years ago but I've always wanted to get a horse in her stable like for her and I was going to get that like Palomino Yorvik Wild 
Um, I don't, but I didn't feel like it actually looked like her, so, um, when, and also, since she was rescued, my parents, like, never really knew when she was born, her, like, date of birth, but the adoption center knew that she was born sometime in February, so they gave her birthday Valentine's Day, so that's when I was gonna buy that horse, but now, um, I, like, I never got it because I felt like in the end it didn't look like her. And, um, I also think Valentine's Day just suits her really well as well because, um, she, like, really looked good in, like, a nice pink color. But, yeah, I think I'm gonna get this horse and name it Millie. Um, other, but I don't know, like, what its Jorvik name's gonna be. So... Its name's either going to be Millie or Angus. I don't know if it's going to be a boy or girl. Um, I did count my horses, and I have 20 boy horses, or 20 stallions slash geldings, and I have 19 mares. So if I get this um, horse and I make it a mare, then that could even it out. But at the same time, I feel like it looks like a boy, too, so I don't know. Let's look at the main style. I don't know if I'm going to change it right now. Because I want to get, like, a good look at it. Um, I do like these, like, new main styles for them. So, this one doesn't look the best. I feel like it just looks really weird. Okay, so, there's actually the braided one right there, too. And then you get the little tuft on, like, their chin. Like, the tinkers or the, um, like, others. So, yeah. Um, but I think I'm going to do not a main style right now. And, um, so that I can, like, look at it. But, yeah, I think I really want to get this horse. Now, I want to get a, um, a, uh, what is it called? An English thoroughbred, the, the Dark Bay English thoroughbred, and I want to name it that bear. So, I was going to name this horse bear, but, like, I also want to name that horse bear. Obviously, I could have two horses named bear, and then... Or I could change, I can name this horse Big Bear or something like that. So, I don't know. But let's go ahead and make them a senior. I'm not sure about the gender. It could be either a gelding or a mare. I'm not sure. But let's look at the A. Um, no, let's look at B names. So, there's Baby, Ball, Banana, Banana. Why is Banana a name? I don't know. Um, Basalt, Bat, Bay, Bear, Beat, B, berry, there's big, <laughs> um, birch, bird, blaze, blind, blue, bolts, um, okay, okay, um, I'm not sure, let's look at the A names, um, I don't know. I don't know what to name the horse. Oh, I am. Oh, I picked. Let's random randomize. Um. Guardian. <laughs> no. Um. I don't know what to name this horse. Uh, I don't know. This is going to be the whole video. Just me trying to name this horse because I don't know what to name it. I'm going to look up. Um. Sh Shire. Shire. Um. Horse names. Whenever I can't name a horse, I just look up horse names. So, um, this one is for the Shire. Okay. Okay, so there are male shires and then there are female. Um, none of the males are really sticking out to me. Okay, there's now female. The, one of them popped up as Epona. <laughs> um...
Okay, so black shadow horse images popped up. So I'm gonna scroll through those. I don't know what to name this horse. <laughs> Okay, um, I don't know, guys, um, comment down below what I should name this horse, even though I, I'm already gonna name it, I don't really care, I just want, I could always change the name too, because I have no idea what to name this horse, like, at all, so... Um, it would help if I knew the gender that I would make it. Um, yeah, I don't know. Uh, okay, let's just keep, I can name it Moon, I don't know. I think Guardian has stuck out to me. Um, because I've always imagined Millie going to heaven and just like watching down over our family and just like still being there, you know? So, Guardian. I like it. Now, I don't know what I will actually make this horse, but right now, its star stable name is Guardian. Um, e either, it could always be a male, too, and just have, like, the presence of Millie. I don't know. I love this horse. Like, the hoof detail is so good. Look how big their hooves are. So good. Okay, so let's go ahead and, let's go ahead and make this horse a stallion for now. I can always change it because that's free. So, yeah, let's go ahead and buy him. Adult, guardian. That says guardian, yeah. Okay, let's buy him. He's so cute. Oh, wow. Oh, he did the little lip thing. Okay, let's send him to the stable. Okay, I don't know if I bought him. Did I buy him? Let's see. My star coins went down, that's for sure, so. Let's call for pickup. Okay. I got him. Yeah. <laughs> I'm excited. Oh, someone has this Shire. So, yeah, they released these bridles, but they haven't released the ones that came out in the teaser that CC Creations posted. So, kind of a bummer, because I was really wanting those, but yeah. Okay, so now, oh my gosh, the last two horses I've gotten are black horses. Wow. I'm gonna quickly give King a bit of water because he's thirsty. All my horses are thirsty, so. Um, yeah. He's eating the bucket. <laughs> Okay, let's go ahead and check out Guardian. Um, I want to see what he looks like in pink, because that was Millie's color. Oh my gosh, I'm so big. Like, oh my gosh, he's so big. Okay, I don't want, like, a sneak peek of him quite yet, so let's just, like, go there. Okay, so let's get some pink tack on him. I think I want to just do, like, a standard bridal. This looks actually really nice on him, but I think I'm just going to do... Yeah, let's X this one out. Okay. Okay, yeah, let's put this one on him. Oh, that's still my bridles. Okay. Um, I got this saddle pad just for Valentine's Day, so we're going to do that one. Obviously, an English saddle because that works. And I got boots. Oh, you can't put boots on these horses. Okay. Well... Let's see. Um, I have a pink. 
flower. <laughs> um, there are many pink bows. Um, does this work? It kind of does work, but I don't like where they placed it, so no. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and click E so that that disappears. Oh no, it's this thing. Okay. Why is E appearing? I hate that they made it so that my game now has this E thing. My game has been acting so strange recently, so... Thanks, Star Staple. Okay, so let's find a good place to do this. I think just in this round pen would be good. So, let's check out his animations. So his walk is nice. It's like a nice lazy but like heavy step walk. I feel like he's just like every step he does, it's just like the ground is about to open up. <laughs> but it's like nice and forward, nice and like a lazy walk. I like that. Okay, the trot. Oh. Okay, it's like it's nice. It's not just like elongated. It's just like a little step. It's just like I'm my legs are hard to pick up, so I'm not going to, like, go very fast. And I like that. His canter is really nice. It's just, like, a small little collected canter. And I really like that. Okay, so his gallop is nice. I don't like how the tail moves. It's, like, weird. Do you see that? Um, but the tail is still being, like, improved, obviously, with the years of tail improvements, so, um, but, yeah, that looks nice, and then his gallop, although he's a bit hard to control in his gallop, so let's go ahead and just make him jump, oh, that looks nice, actually, okay, his gallop is good, it looks like his, I think, left leg looks a bit, like, hurt, is that just me? Like, his left leg, it looks like he, it hurts to put weight on it, but I don't know. Okay. But, yeah, I like it. His mane moves really nicely. I like how it's not just, like, flying up in the wind like the Pasifinos. Uh, let's go into Marley's farm and go check out some jumps for him. I like how it just, like, waves. It doesn't, like, stick up straight in the air. And I like how their tail flows really nicely and their forelock moves very flow flowly -ly. flow flowly it flows very good it's like in their eye at the same time it's not in their eye so yeah i like it okay so let's see his canter jump so this isn't bad i'm gonna hit the jump i know it but They don't like obviously curl. I'm yawning. I'm sorry, guys. They don't obviously, of course, curl their legs because they are like a draft horse breed. Oh my gosh, look at this detail with their hooves. Where's my field of view? Look at that detail with their hooves. Like they're so giants. But um, yeah, they don't like curve them like how jumpers would. I just wanted to say that our character looks really nice in this position. I don't know if they updated the character in the jumping position, but we're actually out of the saddle, which is fabulous. Like, we're not just, like, sitting in the saddle, just, like, the galloping. No, it's like, we're actually out of the saddle. Of course, we would want to be more up on their neck, but, like, it's good for Star Sable, okay? Um, his tail position looks really nice. The Pasifinos would, like their tail would go like that when they jumped so i hate their jump um but their back legs it looks like it could just jump so far and his face is so cute but yeah i really like this okay i know i'm gonna crash into the jump because i yeah um let's put him into this one Okay, so this is the faster jump. Obviously, he his legs are like that again. His tail looks really nice. It's not even in the leg. I was going to say it looks like it's in the leg, but it's not going in the leg. His back leg looks nice to me. And, oh, what happened to 
our stirrups. What happened here? <laughs> okay. Um, again, our character's out of the saddle. I think the only thing is that the stirrups are a bit wonky. It's on the same. It's on both sides. But I do want to say, like, your character, I feel like, looks nice in this position. Obviously, I think she should be more further in the saddle and up on their neck. But improvements were made with this horse's jump. And then their full-on gallop. Their full-on gallop, again, Star Stable actually makes our character jump on, like, go on to two-point on jockey with these horses. So, that's really nice. Again, our stirrups are a bit wonky, but that is okay. And, I mean, I think we look good. This jumping position, of course, farther on their neck. Um, our legs aren't even on, like, the knee pads, but that's fine. Of course, this is a horse game that's been out for been out for 10 years and is still behind on most of their horse games so congrats star stable <laughs> good job i really like how that we actually are in two point or jockey oh let me know down in the comments do you guys say two point or do you sneak peek on the rear do you guys say um two point when like doing the jumping position or do you guys say jockey let me know down in the comments below because i would love to hear like what you do because i say jockey i learned with jockey um but then um uh, when i switch my new barn all the trainers say two point and then they're like or no i learned on two point sorry i'm gotten this mixed up i learned on two points um that the jumping position is two point but then all the trainers on my new barn are like it's jockey and then they're like oh right right insert my real name um you say two you say two point so yeah so yeah, <laughs> um, let's see if it's on the if the horse like is on the correct lead. So this way, I would say yeah. Um, this way though, no. <laughs> um, canter leads. I don't know much about canter leads. But he leads with this right, this right leg, um, so it would be, I think, correct this way? I'm not sure. Um, let's go ahead and check out his sudden stop. It's just, like, a nice slowdown, um, which I like. I'm glad that they, they don't, like, throw their haunches into the sand. They just, like, do a slowdown. Okay, let's check out their backup. Their backup is nice. Um, I do wish that they would look, like, behind them. Since they are a bigger breed, I feel like they would be more self-aware of where their body would be placed, but they're not. Let's check out their rear. That looks like the Wellish Pony rear, I feel like. Like, it just goes up. Like, they go up, they, like, are, like, should I go back down, and then they kick out. So, yeah. Okay, let's go ahead and head over to the main stylist. Um, my user, my f interface is not back. Um, I might have to log out. <laughs> I'm not sure. There we go. Okay. So, yeah. Um, I don't know if I'm going, his, like, roleplay name is going to be Guardian, um, or what, but I do like him a lot. And he, like, just reminds me of my dog, Millie. And I just am, like, I finally have gotten a horse. And, um, yeah. Even though he's not a Palomino or he's not, like, the same color as Millie. And he's a he and not a she. I still like him a lot. So, yeah. Okay, so let's give him a new main style. I think I want to do a beard with him. But let's check him out. So this is the roach, or not the roach, the like mohawk. I don't like it in the photos I did, but now seeing it, I don't really like it. Um, doesn't look the best. I do want to know, does it change the tail? I don't think it does. No, it doesn't. Do any of these change the tail? The braids? obviously change the tail but nothing else changes the tail which i love so thank you star stable um obviously i don't 
usually like braids. These ones I don't, or the plaits. I don't like the braids because it braids the tail. Um, the short mane is actually a little cute with him. Um, but it just does something weird to the forelock. I feel like it's just been chopped like right in half and I don't like that. Like, it just looks like it's just been chopped off unevenly. I don't like that. So this is like the short mane, but like with stuff in the tail um, or stuff in the mane. And then the tail also, does the tail get chopped off here? No, but the tail gets chopped off here and it does not look the best to me. So, um, and then we also have this like one braided mane style, which I feel like I like. Um, I cannot get a good place for this thing. Um, I feel like I like it. It doesn't mess up the tail. And, um... So, this may be a big maybe. Although, I feel like it does, like, do something weird with the mane. Now, obviously, with this one, it just gives them the beard. This one does the same thing, but with the beard. This one is also, like, the braid one with the beard. And then this one is that with the beard. So, I think I just want to add a little beard to him. But at the same time, I like him with a clean face. I'll wait. I'll wait. I'll let you guys know if I change my mind. By the way, I really think pink looks good on him. I actually want to get into, like, a pink shirt. By the way, guys, um, I was able to, if you guys saw yesterday's video, um, I was able to get my roleplay scenes finished. My whole entire roleplay scenes are filmed. I just have to do my voiceovers, and then I have to edit everything together. So, I'm excited for that, and it should be pretty fun. So, I don't feel like that goes good together. I thought I had a pink one of these, but I guess I don't. Um... So, this is what I thought I had. But it doesn't even match that, so. Um. Is there anything that does match it? That's too, way too dark. Yeah, I don't think anything matches it. That's closer, but too light now. <laughs> uh, no. No. They, like, have nothing that matches these saddle pads. Uh, um, I don't think there's anything, really. Yeah, no. Okay. Well, that's fine. Um, I really like Guardian, a.k.a. I don't know. But, yeah, he's really, really cute, and I can't wait to ride him more often. I do want to level up King before I ride Guardian, but yeah. Um, by the way, guys, uh, I am going to ma be making a video for next week that will talk about like my schedule and everything um, with school starting back up again because in exactly one week, I am going to be going back to school. So I'll be talking about that um a little bit and just letting you guys know what i kind of think about it and just letting you guys know everything so i guess not everything everything but just like everything that i um want to tell you guys about it so yeah but uh i think that is going to be it for today's video because king is just king wants to ride and um i have bought in guardian so yeah i love him so much he's so cute <laughs> but that is it for today's video i hope you enjoyed and i will see you guys all next time bye